Russell? What are you doing? <sighs> These caverns aren't much for entertainment, and I really miss my horror movies. So I'm doing the best I can with what I have. I know. I'm sorry our fight with the Decepticons made your home uninhabitable. Maybe soon we'll be able to. <gasps> We made a stealth trip to the scrapyard to salvage a few items. <sighs> Not to worry, B. I scoped it out and made sure Steeljaw wasn't waiting for us. Still, nothing is worth taking that kind of risk. Not even this? My rear axle poster! Rocket! No way! This is awesome! All I need now is a power supply. I believe that can be arranged. Welcome, chillers. Vlad Guestly here. Prepare to have your hair raised and your spines tingled in this week's Showcase of Shivers, tonight at midnight. Blah. What in the name of Solus Prime? Everyone out! Russell? All good. All good. Greetings, my friends. And thank you for your recent change of address transmission. Nice to see you, OP. A little heads up might have been nice. Ooh, ooh, is my teamie with you? Where's Drift? Drift is attending to other matters. I have come to investigate an alarming report from Ratchet, who has been studying Shadow Zone particles. He has registered a burst of those same particles here on Earth. Something's traveled from the Shadow Zone to Earth? Possibly. I have transmitted the coordinates of the burst to fix its command tablet. Received. The outdoor demolition derby where Grimlock first encountered Scowl. If any cons escape the Shadow Zone, they won't stick around for long. Sideswipe, race ahead. Take stock of the situation and report back. Pursue if necessary, but do not engage. I'm gone! <sighs> Sideswipe? Sorry, pal. My TV! Hey, at least it wasn't you, right? Okay, now I'm gone. Sideswipe! Saddle up and get after So it was you my benefactors wanted me to meet here. And I assume it was you directing our mission from the Shadow Zone. I take it that allowed you to break the dimensional barrier? How did he get our Decepticon hunters? A powerful weapon. I remember well when I had one like it. How did you acquire it, may I ask? Those who share my objective genetically engineered a series of activator minicons and programmed them to collect the weapons for me. I suspect those you speak of are the same those who saw to my release from stasis. In that case, welcome to what is soon to be my Decepticon homeworld, brother. 
You are no relation to me, and this world is not yours. You are correct, of course. Technically. I have brought the requested items. Nuclear fusion grade fuel rods confirmed. Why do you want these anyway? This is a transgalactic beacon generator devised from wreckage recovered in the Shadow Zone. When activated at the highest point in the city, it will transmit a signal strong enough to summon Megatron back to Earth. The highest point in the city? But that much radiation won't just call Megatron, it'll... Devastate the city, then spread to eradicate all life on Earth. Incidental collateral damage. That wasn't my deal. I'm to rule Earth, a living planet, not a lifeless wasteland. Your ambitions are irrelevant. Like the activators, you have served your purpose. Find another world to rule. <laughs> Swipe to Bumblebee, come in! Autobot transmission detected. Scramble communications and scan for enemy contact. B, can you hear me? Ah! Ah! Soundwave. Soundwave? He's in the Shadow Zone, isn't he? Not anymore. We have to evacuate Crown City now, before Soundwave destroys it and everything else on the planet. I'll explain on the way. Mayor Trujillo's office. I'm with the Aerospace Crisis Management Agency. Our instruments indicate an intense surge of solar flares will strike the city within the hour. Crown City must be evacuated immediately. Of course, right away. Oh, wait, I've never heard of the Aerospace Crisis Management Agency. Who is this again? Oh no, here comes a solar flare! Everyone evacuate! The military is evacuating the city. But now we can't get in. Never say can't, Strongarm. Follow me. Any luck locating Soundwave? Negative. His stealth tech is too advanced for my limited tracking capabilities. Wait! They said something about the highest point in the city. The Crown City Colossus? The Crown City Bank Building. It's currently undergoing construction, making it the highest point in the city. That's where he's headed. We're en route. I don't get it. Why would anybody destroy a whole city just to send some signal? What about the humans? Disregard for others, intentional or not is the cause of much pain in this or any other world. Kind of like breaking something that a friend of yours really loves. Huh? Did you see Russell when you smashed his television? He was crushed. Oh, come on. I had a mission to start and that thing was in my way. He can get a new one. It was more than just a thing to Russell. It, it represents home, family, and memories. What's more important, our mission or a TV? 
Maybe they're equally important, depending on whose perspective you're looking from. Oh, just forget it. Already have. What do you think, Optimus? We need to draw away Soundwave's air support. Agreed. I shall engage Laserbeak. The rest of us will try to destroy the beacon. May the Primes be with us all. Last one to the top is a pile of rusty scrap! Hold on, Sideswipe. I want us to take on Soundwave with as much power behind us as possible. We're forming the Ultra B-Team Combiner. Without Drift? Can we do that? I don't know, but Drift serves as the Combiner's weapon. Maybe we can form the body without it. Everyone focus. Okay, let's try again. No time, sir. We need a new plan. Something so unexpected, so out of left field, it'll take Soundwave completely by surprise. I like the sound of this. Uh, turns out, it sounded better than it actually is. I didn't hear any great plans from you, punk. Everyone just stay calm. Only 37 more floors to go. Autobots locate. better entrances. Destroy that beacon, whatever it takes. Can a bot without a blaster play? Yes. Strong arm and I will draw sound waves fire. You make a run for the beacon. Go! Processor is receiving your communication. State your intent. Permission to power up granted.
Quick, beacon generator charging. Dispose of the brine and return to site. Consequences are irrelevant? You, 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 you think you could just come to Earth, cause a little kid's television to break, and it doesn't matter? Your comments are nonsensical and inconsequential. Put a socket wrench in it, scrub pile! <laughs> Today, laser beak. It is time to bring you back to Earth. See how well you fight without our weapons. You may have eradicated the generator's energy shield, but your efforts are futile. Profiling, Optimus. I do not follow your meaning, Sideswipe. He means you look spectacular, sir. I think. You must be one of the activators Sideswipe said Soundwave mentioned. Soundwave said you little guys were modified against your will. Who did it? He says the modification was carried out by parties that erased all memory of themselves from the activator's data banks. How did he break his programming and switch sides? His concern for others outweighed his orders. He was horrified to learn his mission would end all life on Earth. Since defecting, he has been following your team, awaiting the moment he could support your efforts. No, these two shall trouble you no further. I will take custody of them and see they stand trial. Yes, I believe the Shadow Zone will make a suitable home for you. No one shall hunt you there. He 
realized his actions had consequences and did all he could to make things right. Welcome to Showcase of Shimmers! We apologize for last night's technical difficulties. We realize our show means a lot to the little dudes at home. And because you mean so much to us tonight, we present a very special live performance of The Monster from Dimension ah! Ah! Run for your chives! Knives! <coughs> Wives! Ah! Oh, I'm from Dimension Ah! Oh, I say Ah oh, a lot! Yeah! 